In today's video, I'm going to show you how to sell ebooks on Gumroad. So Gumroad is this e-commerce platform right here, and you can sell basically anything on this platform. And if we go to gumroad.com, you can see how there are some ebooks at the main page. So you might be wondering how you can start this business too. So that's what I'm going to show you in this video. The first thing you need to do is create your own account. You can click this button and click start selling again. And this will bring you to the sign up page. In my case, I have an account already, so I'm going to look now. After that, you will be right here on your dashboard. And here you can see all my activity, but you will have nothing right here. So to start selling, you can go at the left bar and click on products and then go to the top right and click new product now here you will see different options you can choose depending on what you want to sell for example you can choose a digital product a tutorial an ebook a membership physical product or a bundle in this case we're going to see how to do ebooks so just click right here this is not really important because if your ebook is a tutorial you can either choose ebook or tutorial but you can even choose a digital product since it will probably be a pdf file so it works basically the same then we're gonna set a name i'm gonna just put my ebook right here and set a price if you click right here you will see the list of all the different currencies you can choose for example if i want to for example, let's say US dollars and let's put a price of $9 for this ebook. Now let's go to the next step. Okay, so this is the description for your product. You will need to describe your product right here. You can use AI if you want. In my case, I'm just gonna put this is a test ebook, no description for now. But if you really want to sell a product, then I will highly recommend you to create a good description to attract more potential customers. Now, after you have your description ready, you can customize it however you want. You can underline, put the bold text, make the text smaller, bigger, however you want. You can even add a code, add an horizontal line, quote, insert links, images, a button, a video, or a tweet. I will just leave mine like this. Then you can also set a custom URL. By default, it will be your username.gumroad.com slash L slash and whatever you want. For example, my first ebook. And if you want, you can get a custom domain. If you have one, then the cover, you can do it with AI if you want. This will appear right here. This is the, the cover. Then add your thumbnail. This will be mine, just for this test. And then the product information. You can choose between different call to actions, which will be the button that appears right here. You can choose between I want this, buy this, or pay. We are going to see how all this looks like later. And then the summary of what you will get. We can, for example, type in by putting, by purchasing this product, you will receive a copy of my new ebook. And this will appear right here. We're going to see how it looks like later. We can also add additional details, like how many pages it has, the language, for example or file type or any other thing. Then if we keep scrolling down, you can add different integrations. Like if you want to invite your customers to a circle community or to a Discord server, you can enable or disable this. Then the pricing, you can set a price or you can allow customers to pay what they want with a minimum amount and a suggested amount. So for example, you can set this to zero and there will be no minimum amount or for example, one and the suggested amount will be $10. Then you can offer different versions of your product and you can set some settings. For example, if you want to sell limited copies of your ebook, you can enable this option and only sell 
100 copies. You can allow customers to choose a quantity, which is not really recommended when selling ebooks. You can publicly show the number of sales on your product page. You can use this option if you want to sell limited copies for your ebook. So people will know how many copies there are left. And that's basically, that's everything you need to know to publish your ebook. Now we can save and continue. Here you need to enter the content you want to sell. For example, this is my ebook and then upload the file right here. And that's it. Now you just need to pause it and let's see how it looks like. We're going to preview right here or we can go to the product list and you will see it right here. So let's see how it looks like. Let's go to our profile. This is my website. We can see the new ebook right here, 100 left. If we click, we see there's no cover because I didn't add one. We can see the ratings, my profile, the title of the ebook, the description, the pricing. Now right here, I can set my own price and it's recommended to do more than $10. So let's say I want to pay $10 for this ebook. And here you will also see all the attributes that you have added. So I'm going to add it to the card and that's basically it. Now customers will need to put their email address right here to receive the product. This is the pricing and Gumroad knows I'm the owner of this product. So it says that this will be a test purchase, so I won't be charged, but I won't do it anyways. You just need to add your email address and pay and that's basically it. And finally, the last few things you need to know if you want to start this business on this platform are that if you go to your product list, you can always click the name of your product if you want to make any changes or edit basically anything in your product. So I'm going to click my ebook. This is my test ebook. As you can see here, I'm able to customize wherever I want. I can also copy the link to my clipboard so I can share this product if I want to. Or I could also do this by going to the search tab. And here I will have more different options to share my product basically. And if you scroll down to the bottom, you will see the tags option where you can add some tags and this will help potential customers to know what you are selling. And this option is also very important. You can enable this option to boost your product visibility on Gumroad. Now, another important option is that you can always unpublish your product whenever you want and by clicking it, your product will become private and no one will be able to purchase it. Now, if you go back to your product list, you can also click these three dots right here and you will see this option to duplicate this product. So this is very useful because this way you can use this product as a template because let's say you want to post multiple ebooks with the same template, then you can create a copy and just change the content in that product. You can upload uh, different ebooks and that way you can post multiple products very easily. And the last option I'm going to show you here is to delete your product. You can just click the three dots and delete it. It's very simple. So after that, after you have your product ready, you can check all the detailed information about your store right here. As you can see, you will see the traffic, the location of your customers or viewers, your sales, your views, the total revenue you have made. And you can also go to sales to see detailed information about your sales, your customers. You can see their location, their email, how much they spend and a lot more. And after you have done some sales, you can go to the payouts tab to see all the information about your payouts. Here you can see your total earnings and your current balance. If you go here to settings at the top right, you will be able to set up your payout method. You can use a bank account, Stripe, or scroll down and use a PayPal account. So that's it. This is everything you need to know to start this business right now. 
So I hope it was helpful and thanks for watching.